traveling away from home for their Thanksgiving turkey right now. Brent Weisberg is among some of those travelers this morning. He's live at Portland International Airport. Good morning, Brent. Hey, Ken and Jenny, good morning to you. A break in the action right now, but it has been steady all morning long here at Portland International Airport. I want to bring in spokesperson Kema Simons with the Port of Portland. Kema, good morning to you. Morning. Tell us a little bit about what travelers should expect. Well, it will be busy today, so we're asking that people give themselves plenty of time to get here, advising two hours for a domestic flight and three hours for international, or if you just need a little extra time. So folks are seeing our video right now, and they're starting to say, oh, it doesn't look too busy, but things can really change at a matter of moments. Absolutely especially with the banks of flights. Depending on when your flight's leaving, time is going to be your friend here. So what should people need to know about uh, when it comes to parking at the airport? We saw that uh, it can get busy as well, too. Absolutely. We should have ample parking, but you can always check flypdx.com before you leave home, see what parking is available and where you might want to go. So let's talk about just overall travelers coming through the airport. Uh, fifth year of record-breaking uh, travel. What are you expecting this weekend and then overall long-term for the end of uh, this year? So today, the day before Thanksgiving, we're expecting about 63,000 travelers. The same for Sunday. Those are the peak days for this five-day travel period. Come the end of the year, we're anticipating just reaching over 19 million travelers. So it is record breaking for us yet again. So, what does that really mean about PDX, a fifth year of record breaking travel? We just continue to grow. Airlines are adding flights here, which is fantastic. In fact, we have another new nonstop international flight starting December 1st. Aeromexico will be going to Mexico City. So, more flights means more travelers and um, just more people passing through. All right, Kama, duly noted on that flight because they are partners with Delta, my preferred airline. So, I will definitely be looking into that. Uh, thank you very much for joining us. And we do have a quick uh, reminder for folks if you are going to be traveling, make sure TSA says to check uh, both your carry on luggage and your check luggage to make sure that you don't have any contraband inside of those from any prior traveling. It will save you a lot of headache here at the airport. Back to you guys. Yeah, but it looks like everything's running smoothly and uh, glad to know about your preferred airline, Brent. I, I'm an Alaska fan myself, but, you know, we all have our preferences. <laughs> Thank you. We all have our preferences. Yeah. All right. Thanks. <laughs> thanks, Brent.